Making news, my lovely, wonderful people. The matter with all the yes, so many things with all the happen, say, we say. The Tinubu inauguration, so many not saying a better thing. Me Nigerians know the mate Tinubu and APC know the jump, say, we say. Oh, everything is all right, so we are doing well. Say, the US, they send delegates. He called a review one thing. He said, Tinubu inauguration, when the US accept results of an election, they don't send delegates. What's happening is that they are coming to investigate Tinubu and Tinubu does not even have a clue. They are coming to investigate him and he does not even have a clue. You know, he said if Tinubu knows what they happen, he's not going to do what they do. He's not going to jump. He said that they send delegate they come because they can't watch. They won't see what thing will happen. He said, they, he said get why. The reason they, you understand, say get why. Why did they send delegates? He said they accept results, they don't need to send delegates. He said the reason they send delegates now because they call check things. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Tinubu does not understand what the U.S. are about to do to him. When the U.S. accepts the result of an election, they don't send delegates, according to Daniel Bawale. Earlier today, President Joe Biden announced the designation of a presidential delegation to attend the inauguration of Bola Ahmed Tinubu on May the 29th in Abuja. Ever since the U.S. made the announcement, a lot of reactions has emerged as some lauded what the U.S. government did. Others frowned at it. The spokesperson of Atiku Abubakar, Daniel Bawale's, seemed to, be, seemed, seemed to form a different perspective. He took to his Twitter handle where he said that the United States government does not send delegation to any country during an inauguration of a president if they accept, recognize, and endorse the outcome of the election that produces such president. Instead, the president goes himself. He said that the vice president or the secretary of state can also represent the president. But when a president does not come, it shows there is issues. When Buhari was to be inaugurated in 2015, it was Kerry, the secretary of state, that showed up fat check whenever the u.s accept recognize and endorse an election outcome they send either the president the vice president or secretary of state not delegates of those who are associated with africa that is not the real thing what is your what you are saying right now and what you are presuming is all wrong tinubu is has not been accepted he's been washed and that's why they are sending delegates instead of the president. I thought the vice president went to one of the African countries. How come he did not sh should not show up in Nigeria? At least the vice president can come to Nigeria. He went to an African country very recently, but has not come to Nigeria and cannot come. And they cannot send the secretary of state. Instead, they send a delegation. There are issues. Let me tell you, there are real issues. And in case you are not aware, you think that they've accepted Tinubu, it's a real fallacy. These are lies. Tinubu should understand that these people are not sure, uncertain, unsure about his results. Hence, the drug case is there. They are sending delegates instead of coming themselves and ensuring that they see things for themselves. Tinubu should not go to bed that the U.S. is sending a delegation to his inauguration. He should be worried because this is a matter of concern. Wow, where everybody get perspective of the same matter, but they see things differently. Everybody get different perspective. Which with the year national are quite a different story altogether. Say we say people they look and say uh, something apple say, but they say nothing apple for there. Say the thing when the apple so say now they say now just uh, now just deceit. Say so my people, you can see for your fact that. Things are, you know, people have different perspective and they can analyze things differently in terms of how they see, you know, what is going on and the, the perspective that they can coin out of what is currently happening. That Tinobu is being deceived. You know, this is what Daniel and uh, Bawa is saying of the People Democratic Party that all that is happening, Tinobu needs to be wise. That the president of the U.S. is not too much for him to come. Let's assume, yes, he could not come. That's fine. What about the secretary? Or what about the vice president or the secretary? How come none of them can come? And what they rather do is to send somebody. It shows you that there are issues.
shows you that there are real issues and that they don't want to come you know they don't want to even come to nigeria and if they really want you bawa said that they would have sent they would have you know sent these three personalities that what they do is that they send very important personalities and not just a delegation and if you listen to that list of delegation it's african uh, this person to africa this person to africa this person to africa so it's not like it's a real true test of that you know their loyalty and commitment to say uh, we are coming to you to serve with you to 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 you know to patronize you and to do this and to do that it's really a different ball game altogether if you have to pay great attention and understand exactly what's going on here so it is a, it is a real it's a real 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 serious matter of concern you see so these are some of the things that are happening and every single person you know we are watching and we are seeing how these things are playing out and it's really something that we should really you know understand that this is what is happening today yes today like here and now and so what we see happening is that Tinubu, they are so uh it shows that not just Tinubu, apc they are so wanting the international community you know uh to to show to associ association with international community that they've forgotten that they need to that they've forgotten that they need to you know that they need to you know and uh, they need to pay attention to if there is if there are motives behind what is going on you know it says so that's what is going on here so this is what is happening they say when the u.s wants you they will show you they want you they will not uh, be neither here nor there they will really stay with you but if they don't they try to send a delegation to you and make you know that you are not as important as you think you know so so Tinubu should not get all the hopes all high thinking that you know it's all been sorted the u.s has accepted him he said because they are not sure that's why the U.S. are doing what they are doing. I say, really, say yes. So we'll call the look at together. We'll say, wow. So now where will they be this? So, and we won't make you know. Uh, inauguration, a uh, few days to go. Few days, few days, few days. Few days is just around the corner. And the Nigerians, we all just have to make sure that whatever we need to do, to ensure that this country becomes a pleasant place for us, we do more. Because even right now, the U.S., though the... The uh, UK now, though they, though they stop Jack Bow, uh -huh. those when they come for school before the free bring family come, it, the level though they change you, not be the same thing again, no. not be the same thing again. You don't see her now. So now God will help us. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe, click on the notification button so you can have all our latest news. God bless. Have a fantastic day from us. It's bye for now.